Hey you guys, so check it out. If you guys like what I'm doing and you guys see how much effort I put into this, even though I never used to subscribe to other channels and stuff, even ones that I would watch every day and they would ask me every day to like and subscribe and share and hit the notification bell and stuff, guys, that was, that was me not doing the right thing, I think, because these people do put a lot of effort into it. I realize I put a lot of effort into this and it would really help me out if you guys hit that like button, smash that like button and smash the subscribe button. Guys, please, if, if, a, if a lot of you don't like all the random uh, thank you videos, which I'll never stop doing, but that pop up, you don't necessarily have to hit the notification bell because I don't want to annoy you guys, but it would really help me out if you guys hit like and subscribe. So thank you guys very much for the opportunity. And uh, let's do this. Here we go. What is going on, everybody? How are you guys doing? Thank you guys for being so kind and so loving towards me. I love you guys so much. You guys are unbelievable. You guys are unbelievable. You guys are my family. I will, I will do anything for you guys. You, you guys do so much for me. I'm so excited to have all you guys on this YouTube journey with me. But guess what? We are getting some snow right now. It is snowing in Big Bear. It's not gonna be much. It's gonna continue being light like this. But yeah, it's not, as I said, it's not gonna be much. It's supposed to be just a little dusting, nothing special. And uh, this is what I do though. This is what I do and this is what I love to do for you guys. Anytime it snows, I am gonna be here recording it for you guys. Hang tight real quick, the okay. wife is going. Sorry about that guys. But yeah, we're getting some snow, so we're just gonna go over by Bear real quick just to get a little better snowfall coming down on us. But yeah, I'm super excited to have you guys in my life. You guys are amazing. You guys have uh, really, really lifted me up. Of course, you know, I mean, I'm, I'm not perfect and I have my character defects and stuff like that, but I do the best I can to be the best version of me that I can possibly be. And you guys allow me to be free in terms of who I am internally so thank you guys so much um oh my gosh i am just i am so blown away with you guys never saw this channel going where it's gone and where it's gonna go it's it's just pretty amazing um i am gonna upload a youtube short and probably tomorrow morning to remind you guys about something guys this would mean a lot to me i'm gonna remind you guys in a video just to talk about this but tomorrow by the way we're on willow street in lower moon ridge heading towards club view but yeah it's snowing right now it says 32 degrees but it's not it's definitely uh about 27 degrees outside right now um just real so basically um as you guys know i'm going to be on fox weather doing a three to five minute interview to discuss big bear and the weather and how it's it's impacting us up here um so i was hoping that you guys could just for that taping or that live thing you guys could uh please download the fox weather app it's going to be at 8 45 a.m the earliest on saturday morning or 9 a.m on saturday morning at the latest so have your fox weather app downloaded so you can watch me live on fox weather guys it, i mean it's it's fox weather across the nation type thing like holy moly so anyway i was really hoping to get your your guys's love and support there that would be amazing um and yeah i'm uh I'm just super excited to do this for you guys. Um, for a lot of people out there who have questions about what I do and this and that, and then I get some like really just rude comments about, oh, uh, it must be a conflict of interest what you're doing on YouTube and uh, um, and taking government checks. No, I first of all, I don't take a dime from the government. I own my own business. This YouTube thing is just on the side. I've run my business up here for almost six years and, and everybody knows me for my business up here. So those are really hurtful comments. It really does hurt my feelings when like people hate like that and just have nothing better to do than to be really mean to other people because they have nothing going for them. So that's that's just, I, I, I just wanted to make it very, 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 very clear, you guys. I've been working um, my own business for years up here and this YouTube thing is just something on the side that I'm passionate about as well and you know what sometimes I make a couple bucks off of YouTube which is which is freaking awesome but eight or nine months out of the year I make these videos without anything but for years I was making them without anything I just love to do it I love to do it I love you guys very much it makes me really happy 
reading the comments really, really makes me happy. But for some, for some reason, you know, because I am human, I focus on that one negative comment instead of actually focusing on all the, the thousand positive comments. So just, and if, if anyone has any questions, I, I mean, I'm explaining to you right now, no, I don't take a penny from anybody. I don't have a boss either. I create my, I generate my own income. Um, and it's, it's been, it's been good enough to, you know, get my bills paid, all the basics that I need paid for food, water, gas, electric. Um, so it's, uh, it's meant a lot to me that this kid, me, who was a spoiled, spoiled, rotten guy from Newport beach, when my parents had money until my late twenties, I was a spoiled, spoiled, rotten brat, but my parents lost everything. Here's Bear Mountain, by the way, you, you can't really see it too well. And it, it just really hurts, hurts my feelings that people would talk smack like that because they're, they're jealous of me in, in some way. There's nothing to be jealous of. Just get off your butt and go do something like I'm doing and do something that you're passionate about that other people like and you'll be surprised to see what can happen. Um, as I said, my other business, I've been running it for five and a half years, almost six years up here. And I'm very, very known for that up here also. Um, so I just wanted to let you guys know, those of you who, who have questions, kind of addressing some of the haters too. Um, but other people tell me, Nick, you're, you're, you're growing big time on this YouTube thing and, and you're becoming famous up here. Literally guys, every day when I go out like to the grocery store or something, someone recognizes me and kids ask me for my autograph, which is the, just the most amazing thing. And adults ask me to take pictures with them. And I love it because I feel like, I don't feel worthy of this, you guys. I don't feel worthy of all this love and support that you guys give me constantly. I really don't. And so the fact that you guys do and you guys make me feel like I am a worthwhile human being and that I provide something that really brings interest into your hearts, brings love, brings peace, brings serenity, brings information. My gosh, like that's the greatest compliment I could ever receive. So I love you guys so much and I, I just want you all to know that I am human and so I take some of these things um, wrong. Not, well no, I take it as it's meant to be, it's meant to be a hurtful comment and I don't know why I can't just let those go. Um, it, it really bothers me that, that it takes up so much space in my brain. So thank you guys for being so supportive of me. Thank you guys for showing me so much love. I, I, I never want to let you guys down. I'm going to continue doing what I do. I'm going to keep on kicking butt and taking names. Um, and who knows where this Fox weather interview is going to take me. There's a chance you guys, there's a chance that I could become a full-time Fox weather correspondent for Big Bear. Like the, the one, like how crazy is that? And, mo and so many of you have been with me on this journey for so long and I don't want you guys going anywhere. I don't want you guys going anywhere. I, I, I want you guys to stick around and see where this goes. So anyway, guys, thank you again for everything. You guys are so supportive. With that one comment I'm referring to from today, um, some of you actually defended me before I even saw the comment. Um, and I gotta tell you, you guys are my family. You guys are my brothers and sisters. There's no question about it. Um, you guys support me and defend me more than my own blood. So my mom and dad, a different story. They are incredible people, but my six older siblings and my aunts and uncles, this and that, they're just smug, smug people who have nothing better to do than what, what this guy did. So if you're a hater, instead of being mean to me, why don't you just get off your butt and do something productive and follow your passion instead of trying to tear me down and make me feel bad? Um, because you can do it too, you know? I mean, I never expected this channel to go anywhere. That was never the goal. And by the way, we're in Upper Moon Ridge now. That was never the goal, you guys. The goal was just to record all of this beautiful weather because originally when I moved up here, I was super depressed and I still get that way, but not as much, but I was super depressed. And this channel uh, was a way for me to watch my snow videos and feel better when I'm feeling super depressed. I could watch a video of, of, of it snowing and it makes me feel good. So now this channel has like grown so much. And once again, like you guys are the greatest gift I've ever received. I never imagined that this would happen from this channel. I couldn't have guessed this in a million years. 
I honestly thought that most of the comments would be making fun of me and talking smack and just like, look at this guy, what a dork. He just drives around and doesn't shut up, <laughs> you know? But I mean, it's kind of true, but you guys show me so much freaking respect and I never want to let you guys down. I never want to disappoint you guys. I want to succeed for you guys because you guys have been on this journey with me and, and you guys are pushing me along, giving me great advice, giving me wonderful suggestions. I love you guys. And just a quick interruption, Dan the man. So guys, Dan Payan on on our channel had a, a procedure. Um, he, he had cancer, but he had like an endoscopy or something like that. Um, and he got his results back and he's still cancer free. So Dan, you are the man. We are, we love you so much. We are so proud of you. Dan Payan, you guys, I'm absolutely so humbled by you. You have been so good to me. You have been so loving towards me, just like most of you have. So thank you guys so much. And I really hope you guys watch this video until this point so you can hear about Dan. I'll, I'll mention him again, of course, because that is just such a darn blessing and such a gift from above for him to still, still be cancer free. So I'm so proud of you, Dan. And I can't wait to shake your hand, my brother. You are the man. Dan is the man. Um, but yeah, guys, just please understand that my journey in life has completely taken a huge change because of you guys. And you know what? These are those surprises in life that are so beautiful to come into and so unexpected. Um, and I want to ride this thing till the wheels fall off. And as I said, I, I will not disappoint you guys. I will always do the very best I can, but never ever forget you guys. I am human too. Like I, I have emotions probably a lot more than like others. And, and I get my, my feelings really, really hurt. And you know, I hate to sound so honest about it, but you know what? You guys are my family. So those of you who do support me and do love me and do care about me, I'm, I'm being honest with you. And once again, to the haters out there, you know, there's no need to be like that. Find something for yourself to do. Stop trying to tear down other people who are sacrificing an awful lot, taking a lot of time out of their day and risking a lot to bring you some, what I think is some pretty cool, informative content. You know, that's just, I, you know, that, that speaks volumes on who you are as a person and I wish you nothing but the best. I want you to be happy, all, all my haters out there. I want you to be successful. I want you to kick butt out there. You deserve it too. Just try not to tear other people down while you're in the process of, uh, you know, living whatever life you choose to live. See, I choose to get up. I choose to go out there and get it. I choose to bust my butt but I also chose to follow what I'm passionate about. So I don't work a day in my life, even with my other business, I don't work a day in my life because it's a passion of mine. Um, so guys, I am super, super blessed. I am super blessed. Um, but anyway, that's enough about that. I just really, really, really want you guys to know how much I love you and how human I am. You know, some people really, really look up to me and just because I'm on, in all these YouTube videos doesn't make me any better than anybody else. I am, I'm not even close to that. We are all on an, e on an, on an even playing field. It's just, I chose to bust my butt on this, not expecting or knowing where it was going to take me. Hence the passion aspect about it. I am so passionate about this. I love this so much. It takes away a lot of, a lot of my sad feelings that I get. So thank you guys. And once again, I am done with that. Um, back to the weather. It is snowing pretty good up here in Upper Moon Ridge. We're not supposed to get anything, maybe a quarter of an inch at most, but I'm, I'm predicting less than that, just a dusting from this. Um, it wasn't even supposed to, so a couple days ago it said it was going to happen, and then the next day it said it wasn't going to happen, and then the next day it said it was going to happen. Even today, earlier today, it said this wasn't going to happen, but I noticed that the clouds were getting pretty gnarly out there, and I just kept on staring out the window because I thought we might get snow for maybe one minute, <laughs> like maybe not, not even that. So I wanted to capture everything that I can. I am so obsessed with this, you guys, that I don't want to miss a minute of any snow when it starts snowing. I don't want to miss any snowstorm, nothing. So 
this is what I'm doing. I'm out here driving in some rough parts of town in terms of road conditions, way up, way up at the top of Moon Ridge. It gets icy, the temperature says 28 degrees up here. We are on Villa Grove. Um, let's see here, let's see here. Yeah, 28, now we're on sunny slope, but it says 28 degrees right up there, 7, 12 p.m. And uh, yeah, just please you guys, just keep on doing what you're doing out there. Keep on being the loving people you are because you guys are what my reflection of humanity uh, is starting to really show me now. You guys are what I see most people being like now. When I used to have such a, such a, a, a cynical look on humanity, especially when you watch the news, you guys, especially all the like main news, news networks out there. It's all the same thing about there's so much hate out there. There's so much this, there's so much that like it's, it's all, it's so much about them getting views and making money that they're willing to tear this country apart for all of that stupid stuff, all these lies out there. So just guys, please live your lives as happy as you possibly can. Follow your passion to the fullest. Go out there and get it. Don't let anybody tell you you can't. And just, just, just like me, don't let the one out of every thousand negative comments, you know, get your butt hurt. Because you know what? It's I let this this guy take up space in my head for free. And you know what? <laughs> it's just ridiculous how I let that stuff happen. Um, you guys can do this. You guys are awesome. You guys on this channel are everything to me. I am so thankful to have each and every single one of you in my life. I mean, there's no hyperbole being used there. I am so thankful for every each and every single one of you. And look at this. We're getting like foggy with snow coming down. Um, I have some ideas for this channel also. And these ideas are to help you guys. And you guys have given me some of these great suggestions also. So just please understand, I'm, I'm just here to help. I'm not here to be, uh, you know, just talked down to or made fun of or... Um, you know, that's, that's, that's not why I'm here. I'm here to help you guys out. And once again, I realize that the more success you get, the more other people are, are going to start saying negative things and hating and trying to sabotage you any way they can. And the way I should be looking at it is I, sh I should be flattered that I'm actually getting to that point. Look at this snow coming down now. What's going on here? What's going on here? There's snow there. Okay, let's uh, let's uh, let's 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 turn on the the zoom real quick so we can kind of see a little better. If we can't, no, nope, we're not seeing much better when it comes to the snowfall rate. But yeah, I'm super honored to be here, you guys. Without you guys, this channel is nothing, absolutely nothing. And sorry about this long rant. I hope it didn't annoy anybody. It's just I always like to speak from my heart because there's no other way to speak when it comes to me. I wear my heart on my sleeve as you can see, <laughs> um, how I let someone who's essentially no one in my life take up all this space in my head. And I said I'd stop talking about it, but I somehow I reverted back to it. So anyway, let's get back to our weather. Um, oh yeah, look at this, look at the snow. That is just so awesome. That is just so awesome. We are still in Upper Moon Ridge. turn off our brights because we got a car coming but yeah some of the the videos I'm gonna do in in the future are, are stuff that I thought about doing but I just I just haven't gotten to it for some odd reason you guys su suggested me showing where the, t the new Tesla charging station is up here and stuff like that I'm so happy to do that for you guys because I've seen so many Teslas up here and we're gonna go down a very difficult road to go down this is Butte I'm not a fan of this one when it's snowing. Um, and then also I was gonna have a friend of mine put on tire chains and explain exactly what he's doing while he's putting on the tire chains so you guys can see. Um, I'm gonna be interviewing 
the Big Bear Coffee Roasting Company next week, the owner, and and going through his shop. I, I Guys, I really wanna support as many people as I can and help these, these business owners in this town to succeed to the best of their ability. And if I can have some sort of outreach like that, you guys, of course, that's that's exactly what I'm gonna do. I am not a selfish person. I am not a selfish per a selfish per selfish person at all. And I want our town to thrive. And and I want our town to thrive with an A plus rating. You know? I take responsibility for you guys. I I feel responsible for your safety when you come up here. And that's something that's not easy to like grasp and deal with some sometimes, but it's worth it. It is absolutely worth it. And I, I, I go way out of my way. I don't hardly get any sleep. I don't take drugs. So imagine hardly getting any sleep without anything to help is not, is not easy. And uh, I have Crohn's disease really bad. I'm tired all the time and still I'm working about 100 hours a week, about 60 on my regular job and about 40 doing this each week maybe more of more than 40 hours because all I'm doing all day while I'm at work and doing my other job is when I'm not with someone, I am constantly responding to these comments. It's a nonstop thing, you guys. I have over 3,000 videos, so the more subscribers that I get, the more people are starting to, you know, comment on my old older videos and stuff and trying to see like, oh wow, what, what's he done before and this and that. And so, it's, it's just, guys, it's a straight up blessing. And I'll continue working as hard as I possibly can. If there were more hours in, 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 you know, in the day, I'd be doing more work for you guys. Um, we're on silver tip now, by the way. This is another little scary road. But yeah, guys, um, I just, I, I can't thank you enough. I, I can't articulate it, how much I love you guys. Because I really do love you guys. I'm, I don't just say that. I really do love you guys. When you guys are hurting, I'm hurting. When you guys are celebrating something great, I'm celebrating with you. I love you guys, and I want nothing more for you guys than happiness, love, and success in your life. Peace and harmony always. But as I said, one thing that comes with your growth and possibly success is other people trying to tear you down and um, just out of pure jealousy. And I don't understand that whole jealous thing because it's not like I make any money from this YouTube thing. I get donations every now and again, which is so unbelievably beautiful. But guys, those those donations are essentially the only money I make off of YouTube. You know, as I said, about eight, eight or nine months out of the year, I don't make a penny from like Google. But occasionally I'll get sent something. And it's on the 21st of, of the month and most of the months I'm not receiving anything. I just want you guys to know that. And my hope is, is that I can, so I don't have to, you know, be constantly busy. I can give my wife the attention and time that she she definitely deserves. I'm always working and it breaks my heart because she's always wanting to be with me and I'm leaving at odd hours in the middle of the night constantly, but she's such a good support system and it breaks my heart that she can't get as, as much time for me as she wants right now, but I keep on telling her that you know, don't worry, one day, one day, this this thing may be something to where we can live off of it. And guys, what a freaking awesome thing, right? Like, following your passion and actually, like, surviving from it? Like, how cool is that? I mean, how freaking cool is that? So, that's that's what I essentially want, you guys. And I want all of you to be on this journey with me for a long time to come, forever. And it's just really, really important to me that all of you are doing well. And you guys are welcome to share anything with me. I'm not just, like, I don't just copy and paste my responses. I've never done that. I give you guys personalized responses and I take a lot of time to do it because I do love you guys so much. So anyway, um, right now we're back in Lower Moon Ridge. I just can't thank you guys enough. We're back in Lower Moon Ridge. We are gonna take Evergreen over by Snow Summit and check out Summit real quick. And then we're gonna head back to Mikasa. But yeah, guys, just thank you so much for loving me. I mean, all, 
I'll tell you guys that every single video. Thank you for loving me because the people who were supposed to love me, like my family members, as I said, my mom and dad were always super supportive and super loving, but everyone else like always, always told me, I, I, you know, I was going to amount to nothing. I'm a loser. And, and these are the people that you listen to, the people that love you the most. So I want all of you to, to, to take, you know, take a lesson from what I am telling you. Those of you struggling with like similar issues with your friends and your family and stuff, guys, follow your passion. That's all I can say. Who would have thought I'd, I, I, I'd make a penny from doing this, you guys? Who would have thought? So, you know what? Follow your passion, and no matter what, whether you make any money, you're going to be happy, okay? The money is just icing on the cake if it happens. But if it doesn't, I'm still going to continue doing this because it makes me happy inside. And that's all that counts, you guys. Just do what makes you happy. I mean, that's, that's, the, that's literally the best advice I can give those of you struggling with what I used to go through um, and still going through to a certain degree today. And now we, as I said, we're on Evergreen, still getting some, some snow coming down. That was pretty cool to see it snowing kind of heavy up in Upper Moon Ridge. As I said, this is, this is like, it's not gonna last long or if it lasts a couple hours, it's gonna be the heaviest at this rate down here. Um, we could see a quarter inch at the most, but I don't even think we're going to see that, as I said. And then there's no snow coming. Absolutely no more snow coming in the near future. My forecasts, my long, long range stuff doesn't show a thing. Um, except for yesterday, something popped up for this Saturday, which is kind of weird. Another little tiny, tiny little disturbance like this that's not supposed to have any impact on our town. Um, so we shall see. I'll, I'll keep my my eyes and ears open for that so I can make sure I share it with you guys. But yeah, um, I, I, man, I tell you guys like 20 times each video how thankful I am for you guys. I am, I really am. I have a life. I don't think these hardcore thoughts that I used to think. Guys, I was in a place even just in the past year where I want, like when I was riding my motorcycle, I would tell myself, you know what? like if you crash on on the next block hopefully it's an instantaneous thing and you don't feel it but you'd be better off like guys no one wants to live like that no one wants to think like that that's a horrible horrible feeling to be in so much pain that you don't care if you don't wake up in the morning or you don't care if you crash your motorcycle as long as it doesn't hurt um you guys have taken that all away from me. You guys have given me hope and given me something to look forward to. That's the, the guys, I don't re think you guys realize how impactful you guys really are on little old my life. I, I love you guys so freaking much and I am always gonna be here for you guys. I never want you guys to, to ever think any differently. And just, you know guys, just wake up each day, try to be the best person you can. Try to be as kind as you can to your neighbors. Try to be just as loving as possible. Give people the benefit of the doubt, you know? And when when people wrong you, you can just, you know, essentially just walk the other way and just block them. Just be done with it. And we're at Snow Summit. This is where you pay for your, your tickets right here to go skiing and snowboarding. Let's see. They're making a lot of snow up there, as you can see. Anyway, guys, I love you guys so much. Um, <laughs> I'll never stop telling you guys that. Thank you guys again for supporting me through everything through my ups and my downs. It's just being human. And you guys make it very, very, very worthwhile for me doing what I'm doing because of the love that you guys show. As, as, as I said, I, I'm, I, I'm gonna do it anyway. But the love makes me feel so good. <laughs> Now we're on Switzerland.
So yeah, guys, I'm really looking forward to this Fox weather interview. I'm still nervous, but a lot of you have calmed me down <laughs> because I was beyond nervous. And I still am. I mean, three to five minutes, what am I gonna, like, of course we had a phone interview. I don't mean to say of course, like I've done it before, but we had a phone interview and I'm assuming that some of the questions they asked me are, are, are gonna be asked again, but for live TV. And I'm just hoping that I don't choke or like say anything that's super wrong. I would be super embarrassed if I did. And uh, yeah, back to the weather real quick. Well, you know what? Let me show you where we are located right now. There's, there's, there's no one behind me in any cars, so I'm not holding anybody up while I'm going really slow showing you guys. We're right on top of Snow Summit. It shows right there. Oh man, I love this weather. I love this weather. I love you guys. I want us all to take this journey and look at it as if we're taking it together. Because we are. We really are. With, with Without you guys, this journey is not the same. So once again, thank you guys for loving me. Thank you for being my friend, for supporting me, for having my back. I couldn't ask for anything else. So anyway, I think we're going to stop the video right here, but I do love you guys immensely. Um, I know I've said that too many times in in this video, but it's the absolute truth. So every one of you struggling like I struggle, hang in there. And if you need to chat with me, feel feel absolutely free. I am absolutely here for you guys always. You guys take care. I love you guys a ton. If, if you enjoy my videos, please hit like and subscribe. I would really appreciate it. It really helps me out and my bottom line um, when it comes to like subscribers. So thank you. And uh, I'm always here for your questions. Whatever you want to ask me, I'm... I'll be honest with you guys about absolutely everything. I want you guys to have a good time when you come up here. I want you guys to be safe. I want you guys to want to come back to Big Bear. And I know like the this, this, this statistics show that not a lot of people do end up coming back. So because of such bad experiences. But I'll tell you what though, this is such an incredible town with some very amazing people. Um, some of the most loving people I've ever known in this town. So just give this place a chance. Let me do what I can to help you guys. And uh, just please enjoy yourselves up here. And thanks again. I love you guys very much. If you enjoy this, please like and subscribe. I would really appreciate it. As I said, it does help me out, um, I think. <laughs> I've, I, I started doing that a week ago because my wife and my mom have been asking me to, saying, Nick, you have something here you're providing a pretty cool service and you know what this could grow for you and maybe you could you could eventually live off of what you love to do and so I decided after many many years guys it was eight years I've never asked for one subscriber or one person to hit like or the notification bell or anything in eight years go back to all all my videos from uh, December of this last year back you'll never see it once I think I was the only YouTuber, literally, in the history of YouTube who never asked, especially after his channel grew so much. So thank you guys. Um, that would help me out a lot. It would be awesome to see like 20,000 subscribers someday. Like, I, I can't believe it. Fill up a stadium with all of you. Like that's crazy. And we're going to do a lot of big things together, you guys. I'm going to do things hopefully that can provide you guys like places to stay and stuff like that. I want to do everything I can for you guys to show you guys that I really, 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 really do love you. Um, I'm willing to do whatever it takes for the most part. Okay. So I'm going to keep on doing what I do for you guys go out of my way and, uh, try to find other content up here that would make sense for you guys. That would actually be something that would be, you know, something, something helpful. That would be great. So anyway, we are back here at Moon Ridge Road. The drive has just, com we have just completed the drive. Thank you again, I love you guys, and have a great, great, great rest of your day and evening. And um, if you're in Big Bear, thank you to all the locals who support me. I really appreciate you guys. I hope I make a good represent representation of this town for you guys, because I love it dearly. Peace out, you guys, and I know I ramble a lot. Peace.
Peace out. Take care. Bye. Oh, one, one, one more time. It's uh, January 19th, 2023.